Hi, I'm Neil deGrasse Tyson. I'm an astrophysicist with the American Museum of Natural History, and I host Star Talk. Welcome back to Star Talk Radio. <laughs> and it's fighting all these air molecules. Like, what's up with that? Thank we you. win. Astrophysicists win. Oh! Yeah, I said it. Snap! Bada bing! Wow, 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 wow! I'm getting it! So, Curiosity is one of a whole series of rovers, landers and rovers, that have been to Mars, and we're looking for water. We're looking for signs of organic chemistry, the building blocks of life. It's quite the carrot for us as explorers of the solar system. But life is the most complex expression of chemistry that we know. And so why not look for it elsewhere where we know the raw ingredients can be found, such as Mars. So the images are great, the findings are great, the location they selected for it, by the way, Curiosity was all in the news because of how it had to land. It was a very Rube Goldbergian system. Comes in, there's a drogue chute, a regular parachute, some retro rockets. It hoists down the lander. You can't let the rockets exhaust their fuel because then it would just fall on top of the lander. So they then have to sort of fire themselves out of harm's way. It was like, this is I, this was never gonna work. In fact, I opened up a Twitter conversation with the Curiosity rover before it landed on Mars. I had a private communication channel. By the way, Curiosity is female in case you were wondering. Uh. So I was asking Curiosity, are you scared about the landing? Said, well, the engineer said it'll be fine, so we're fine with that. I said, okay. Uh, but it landed beautifully and was quite the news story when it hit. Touchdown confirmed. We're safe on Mars. Yeah! The celebrities showing up, maybe they needed some extra PR for their movie, I don't know, but I think there's genuine interest in people who are not just the engineers and scientists on our exploration of Mars. So it's all good and it's yet another step in our search for life in the universe.